the peppermint smell is on wow. fire. It's like toothpaste. <laughs> right? That's so gross. I mean, what else is peppermint? It's so gross. My sisters ended up not coming, so I'm here solo. So it's gonna be an adventure for one. Wait. Oh my gosh, is that. Hello. Oh my gosh, your shirt lights up. I, I said that's that's light up. Hey! Hello. Happy birthday! Look at this! <laughs> my whole life, I've been wanting to go on your favorite ride because you always talk about it. You guys, they don't know what's coming. I'm so excited to experience your favorite ride. I've been hearing yes. about this for years, I feel like, for me. And if you guys don't know, it's the uh, Runaway World Family. <laughs> So much fun. Lizzie and Rylan seem to love it, so I'm glad that I didn't fail them and they lived up to the hype. <laughs> we broke free. Oh, they broke Come free. On. Let's get out of here. You're so cute. <laughs> it kills me. Stop it. Get, this is me the whole time. <laughs> oh my oh gosh. gosh. You just have to bear it. This is what vlogging in public is like, Sandy. <laughs> We're heading to Pirates. Woo! Wait, here. Let's Let's actually time it. Okay. 808. So let's we'll see. see. 808. <laughs> I'm at 813. This is a steal. All right, let's do it. Update it was not five minutes. It broke down and we had to leave. Literally. It was a stampede. Everyone started leaving. <laughs> it's really sad, but it's okay. I think it's going to come back up in probably 20 minutes. They're all breaking down today. All right, guys, this is the Blue Bayou restaurant in Pirates of the Caribbean. And I don't know if you guys have ever met Rylan, uh, New York's best food critic. Here I am. <laughs> Wow, this is a little, <laughs> put it in your mouth. <laughs> it does look really good. Oh, here. Oh, yeah. Get to look how it. gorgeous. I really wish I knew Spread it was in all the different Let layers. Let see the layers. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm going in for another bite. Oh, that's it's good. good. Alright guys, heading out. Had a great time and I'm so happy I bumped into Lizzie and Rylan. Got some goodies. Bag secured. So I bought some holiday treats from Disneyland and I thought it would be fun for us to taste test them. To make it interesting, Jared thought of a fun game. I'll let him explain. So I figured to make this more interesting, we're gonna judge them based off of look, flavor, and would you buy this again? These two are gonna be one through five and this one is a yes or no. And then we have all the names of them. PM is Peppermint Marshmallow, CCP Creepy Cake Pop, Mickey Mouse Santa Claus Caramel Apple, as well as the Cupcake. And then, of course, the Rice crispy Treat Tree. Ooh, all right, I'm ready. So which one are you excited about? I'm the most excited, I would say, about this one right here. That's what I'm excited about. But what do you want to try first? I'm going to let you pick. I want to try the snowman. So this is going to be the one. The creepy cake <laughs> pop. So there it is. So if you see, I don't know if you can tell, but it has like a sour strip on top. Ugh, it gets worse. <laughs> as, why would you want an M&M next to a sour strip? I'm excited. Well, are we both going to taste it? Yeah, we're both going to taste it. We, we got to take turns. All right. Wow. Yeah, so put this on very plate. cool. Very professional. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Are you cutting icing? Uh, I take my taste testing very professional. Okay. Jared's trying to taste test it. Some ASMR. <laughs> cake pops are either like real gooey or they have a moist cake-esque mm. vibe. That just tasted like I just ate like a spoonful of peanut butter. So next up is going to be the Mickey Mouse Santa Claus Caramel Apple. And you just cut it. What was that experience like? It seemed like a challenge. <laughs> it was very difficult. I gave you the part that has a marshmallow. Is that what the ears are? Yeah. So I'm excited to see what it tastes to you like. Gooey. You're a connoisseur of caramel apples. Is it hitting all the notes you want to hit? I really like this. I feel like these like little sprinkles give it just like a, such a different texture. But I don't want to give too much away because I don't want you to know what my scores are. 
Okay, let me try it out now. So I've been eyeing these ears since the jump. I almost just ripped one off and ate it. So let me try that first. Get any of the apple? I got, I got to get a perfect amount, just barely any. But let me actually get a full apple bite. It's not welcome in my mouth. It's all over my teeth. I like it, it, it tastes good. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna take another bite. Do it. So by your request, you wanted to try this one next. The peppermint marshmallow. Looks beautiful on camera. <laughs> caramel, caramel oozing yeah. out of it, all kinds of stuff. So you're gonna cut, cut a piece off, try yes. it out, and then I'll try some, right? Okay. Ooh. Wow, that's actually a lot harder to even cut than uh, wow. the apple. All right, so try it out. The peppermint smell is on wow. fire. It's like toothpaste. <laughs> right? That's so gross. I mean, what else is peppermint? That's so gross. I don't like it. Okay. I'm not a fan of peppermint. I'm not a fan of marshmallows. I don't like it at so, all. So you kind of share the same vibe that I have of the caramel apple. It's not a good combination <laughs> of these things because alone you might like them, right? No. Were you hoping you might like it? I was going in very hopeful. Okay. But I think the peppermint is so much that it like threw me off. I'm going in. Oh, this is from a fan of peppermint and marshmallow. I think I might prefer peppermint with only with white chocolate. Did you just throw that whole piece in your mouth? <laughs> I need to get a good a good sample testing of it. <laughs> That's so gross. Ugh. It tastes like a York peppermint patty with way too much going on. I don't like it. I don't like anything about it. That one baffled me. I thought I was going to like that one. As you guys saw, Jared came up with a very intricate system to name the... Well, uh, it's not that hard. Tree. Mickey Mouse caramel apple. That's... What is that one? <laughs> <laughs> Mickey Mouse, Santa Claus, caramel apple, cupcake, <laughs> Rice Krispie, tr Christmas tree tree. Yeah, what's not to know, right? It's just super easy. Oh, that wasn't that hard. Ooh. All right, you guys, I'm taking a bite. The caramel apple connoisseur. An immediate reaction. What are you thinking? Classic. Between the two caramel apples, which one just are you gravitating towards? I think the other one. Only because the other one has those <laughs> sparkles that have like the different texture. Okay, so let me try it now. I'm gonna get a good amount of apple, but I want to really focus on the complete mix of flavors. Do we have a caramel apple fan now? No, it's not bad. I would say the tartness of the apple lends itself to offsetting the sweetness of the caramel nicely. And then the marshmallow does add something special. However, I'm facing the same <laughs> issues with caramel just attacking my teeth. <laughs> I'm getting 99% apple with this one. You did eat most of the marshmallow. Okay, I'm, I'm ready to get my score. <laughs> For someone who said doesn't like caramel apple, you just took another bite while, no, I didn't while we were setting up. <laughs> <laughs> no, not of the caramel apple. I bit the only good thing it had going for it off of it, which was the marshmallow. I've been eyeing it. I just wanted to have it. Oh, I wasn't trying to be his name. <laughs> so we got the Rice Krispie Treat Treat. That's glisten right there. Yeah, I like the little sprinkles, the clear sprinkles on top. Is there any surprises hitting you immediately? Are you thinking, wow, I didn't expect that. It's okay. That's it? Yeah. I'm gonna take another bite though, just in case. <laughs> All right, do it. Did that add anything to it or did that just solidify the okayness? I really like the sprinkles. I'm excited for this one. <laughs> I know you're excited for this one. I'm waiting for a kick. Yeah. I don't know if it's my sinuses. Maybe <laughs> like I'm not able to taste things completely right now. I didn't get anything extraordinary from that. If you told me that was organic and like made with like wild oats, I might believe you. It didn't have any kind of flavor pop. I feel like I've already mentally scored it. I'm ready to put pen to paper. You're looking very serious. I need to be fair and I need to be concise. After the review, I think we all know what he's going to score it as. It was a hard one, but <laughs> I put pen to paper and I did it. Look how cute this is. Hi, hope, little bow. I hope we're not disappointed. <laughs> Looks have been very deceiving. Is that a thing? Can you, do people do? Oh. Well, I think the paper will just. Uh -huh. Does it feel moist on the knife? It feels very moist. Oh, moist alert. Mm -hmm. Wow, look at it just gliding through the fork. <laughs> okay. Just so you know, this is red velvet cake. Okay, she's going in for a second bite. I don't even want to say, because I think it's going to give what I'm going to vote for. So you just said it. <laughs> I mean, what is it? <laughs> Why don't you just not say anything? There, I've said enough. All right, he's just going to go straight off of the paper. <laughs> I'm rooting for that to be fond on. I'm okay if it's hard icing. You didn't really get a ton of icing, huh? If I did, I'm disappointed. This is straight icing. I don't recommend you try this. 
I take it back. You gotta try that. <laughs> wow. It's obviously a heavy buttercream. I, I could tell that. It lends itself nicely to the texture of the cake. Is it my favorite of all of them? You'll have to find out. I wanna try to guess what you thought was the best and what you thought was the worst. Mm -hmm. I think you thought the best was the cupcake. I think you thought the worst was the peppermint marshmallow. Eek. Oh my God. Okay, what was the best? The best was, let me look at your acronyms again. <laughs> what is it? If you need help, I'll tell you. <laughs> it was the MMSCA. Mickey Mouse Santa Claus Caramel Apple. Yes, that was my favorite. What was the score that you overall gave that? 10. This one right here. Ooh, that got a perfect score. A perfect score, and I would definitely buy that again. Do you think I gave anything a perfect score? Probably not. Okay, so what is the worst? What is the worst thing that you picked? I want to say my least favorite, the end. So I was right. On that one, you were right. All right, let me see what you picked. What do you think I had on the top of my list and then on the bottom of my list? You might be surprised. I think the top of your list is going to be the uh, cupcake. Yes, it was the <laughs> cupcake. It got a nine. As you can see here, if you want to see my scorecard. I gave it a five for looks and a four for taste. I did feel like there was a tiny bit to be desired on the flavor. However, once I got that spoonful of frosting in my mouth, <laughs> kisses to the chef. Okay, what do you think was my least favorite? The peppermint marshmallow. Ironically, oh, no. no. Let me finish. It's something I would say, then I forgot. There's a creepy uh, snowman. Did you see it? No. The creepy cake pop, <laughs> yes. That got a three for looks because I just didn't get it. It felt uninspired to me. It's a snowman. Yeah, but with a sour belt on its head and like a for jelly the, bean. For like the, I mean, the earmuffs. Who wants you sour? Just gotta get, you have to be a little creative. That was, you know? that was, yeah, okay. Well, how about on the path to creativity? That's part of it, I guess. I just didn't enjoy the taste. Yeah. Yeah. What was the taste? What was the flavor? I don't know. Are we like professional Disneyland treat tasters? It's something I've always strived to be, <laughs> you know? But you know what time it is now. We can't end this off without the advent calendar. <laughs> you heard him. Let's get day seven built. That's gonna do it for day seven of Felice Navi Vlog. Leave in the comments below which Disney treat you wanna try, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Whatever. Felice Navi Vlog. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. This is the vlogmas of Sandia. I